Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, happy time zone, everybody. This is the Road to Dusk. You can call me Road, Dusk, anything that you would call a friend. I am a dream musher focusing on sleep, dreams, and the imagination to help create an environment where people can learn to be the better versions of themselves. I still have the cute box on. Ah. Need to fix that. Actually, let me make it just a little bit bigger. Because why the hell not? Yeah, really hope that everyone has been having a good uh, time so far. There we go. Got that ready. Uh, <laughs> I don't know um, how much we're going to do stuff for tonight with Clothes of the Lamb. I might switch it to something else and I might hop in a VC to like hang out with folks. Actually, you know what? Fuck it. I'll do that right now. Kind of impromptu. Sorry. Scooch myself. There we go. But ye. Yeah. Really hope that everyone has been doing well. I'm just kind of chilling. Daggum. And I haven't been able to post in a whole lot of spots. <laughs> But we should be good to go, regardless. Let me turn that off. Let me get it to where y'all can hear the game. Okie dokie. So I know that it's kind of a quiet night for a lot of folks right now. It's Thursday. We're probably wanting to get through the week. Get past Friday so that we can have our weekend. I get it. It's understandable. I'll be chilling with everyone here while I'm doing some maintenance. If things get to a point where people like want me to focus on something else, I am more than open to do that. But um, that aside, I do want to remind folks we do have the optional Donathon set up early um, in congruence with the um, affiliate anniversary that we have coming up on this Sunday. Uh, sorry, brain is struggling to word right now. <laughs> it, it's been an interesting day. It, it's a little, it, it was a lot more spoons taken out of me than I expected, but I am still rolling with the punches. But... Hold on. I'm gonna let this play a little bit. Oh snap! Faith has been increased. Well, thank you for that. And another death. Daggummit. I'm gonna let y'all take care of that. Okay. Really? Because I'm here, no one took care. Daggum. And of course, someone got sick. Who do I need to take care of? It was tree blood. Alrighty, daddy. Well, that's at least been mitigated. Might need to start recruiting more people though, cause fucking hell. <laughs> Actually, I might need to send people in a brainwash so that I can... I might need to do my typical get everyone high as hell, have everyone fasting. So that I have more time to get materials. Notaic, hope you're doing well. I forget, are you in the cult? If not, do you want to be part of it? I do have a few followers on standby to indoctrinate. Also, let me double check actually that I have my TTS on. Okay. 
Apparently not. Let me also do this. Pulling up a few things, don't mind me. Don't tell anyone this, but I have figured out a small secret to uh, help with streams and help with numbers. If you are a small streamer, if you have multiple devices, like I do, like I use my iPhone for like my tracking and whatnot, but, 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 I also have my iPad that I use for a lot of my drawing. So I use that, have the volume extremely low, but loud enough to where like it monitors and sees it as like an active viewer. And I put my live stream Not on my tablet. <laughs> so I I am. Not letting you customize. Okay. I will have to double check the graveyard. Oh wait, easiest things that I can do. First off, I need to have people fast. Because another thing that I can do is I can just uh, look in all the folks that have died. And if you're here, I can resurrect you. All right, time to raise the dead. Let's see, Hypsy, Clypey, Serenity, Grolf, Domino, Serata, Knightley, George, Almond, Shackmo, Putty, Monkle, Void, Bark, Sunshine, Calamar, Coggy, Um, so many deaths. So many dead. I forget which one is actually connected to. <laughs> They're flipping uh, Twitch. Okay, let's see. Road is adorable. Thank you, Legal. I appreciate it. <laughs> okay, Not looks like you're either alive or something, but. Regardless, Did I die? uh, your older uh, version of yourself that's not connected to your Twitch is dead. Let me see, is your normal version dead? Yes, I shall bring you back to life, Legal. Legal! Where are you? Where are you? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Also, hopefully this is working well. Read mind. Curse. Yeah, Corrupted yeah, yeah. by the resurrection will hey, need dear. to be specifically healed. I am alive. Yeah, but you're apparently cur- Oh, you're a little mad. A cutie at apple underscore discord. <laughs> apple! How's it going? Wait, I forget. Are you in here as well? Because I'm going to be honest. I was... I was doing a whole bunch of extra maintenance and a little bit of grinding prior to stream tonight. Namely on materials and whatnot. And unfortunately... The community has suffered. We are down quite a few people. Nope, I don't have this game. What I what? am not mad. <laughs> no, mad, not mad as in like angry. Mad as in like that, uh, as in like how the Brits use it. Game. Huh, yeah, you I don't, don't see me alive here either. Huh? Hold on. Are you in here? Knightley, George, Munkle, Void, Agate. Yes, really. Just use the Twitch Derp. integration. Yeah, there's a Twitch integration on screen. If you are on mobile, uh, press on the screen and there should show like a little uh, red and black uh, thing. 
click on that, and if you haven't already, you can start creating a little character. Domino, ghostly. Huh. Don't see me alive here either. That's weird. I don't know if the game is just being weird or something. Also, let's do a quick double check to see that the integrations are working right. Would someone feel comfortable with doing a quick attempt at a contribution? Or if it's less expensive, do a character message. I'll be keeping an eye. Oh, okay, it works. Let's go, go wild. Also, no take. You remember uh, last night how I had to refund you the one, the one thing. I now have a working. What do I have to do to make a character? Uh, so Apple, if you haven't made a character already, when uh, are you on desktop or are you on mobile? Um, if you are on desktop, you should just be able to hover your mouse over my my stream on Twitch, and mobile. Okay, on mobile, then you should be able to tap your screen. Uh, and actually, hold on, where? Because normally there should be a way to show the different stuff. Oh, toward at the chat, at the very, very top of chat, there's going to be a little widget that says Cult to the Lamb, and it looks like the game's logo. You click on that, and then from there, you can start creating your own character. The Companion of the Lamb is what it's called. That should give you uh, the opportunity to create your own character. I uh, just see other people's. Huh. Wait, let me see if doing this will give you the opportunity. Let's do the follower raffle. Here we go. I'm no touchy. So Can now there should have been a pop up. There should have been a pop-up uh, for folks to like participate in the raffle. If you click on that, you Got should it. be able to hop into the participants. But yeah, no take. If you remember what I had to refund you last night, uh, you don't. I don't have to refund that for you anymore because I got something new to help out. <laughs> Yeah, Notaic, I'll have to look to see where your character is, because, yeah, I'm surprised that you're not able- Oh! There you are! <laughs> it now allowed me to do it XD. Okay, that was why. All right. Now let's get this one prepared for Apple. Oh. Oh, yours is so cute. It's a red fox. Nice. But yeah, if y'all all the floof. But yeah, don't forget to do contributions for the totem often when you can, because the more contributions that you give, 
it gives me basically a will to spin that can give us either a uh, special like what twitch related exclusive uh like follower forms or even god tiers Need to inspire. But actually, this just reminded me of a thing. Thank you for the contribution. I have been saving this for y'all. Wait. Oh, I, I am one short. I am one short. Are you fucking kidding? <laughs> Also, I have a, a short that's going to be made soon. Well, rather going to be posted soon on uh, YouTube and a whole bunch of other spots. I probably ought to add it to like my Twitch story because, oh my God, it is so funny. I will give y'all a hint. It relates to a very funny moment from when I was doing Final Fantasy 14 on Sunday. <laughs> And I hope to all that is holy that I don't get that I do not get copyright struck because it is too good. All right, now, now I can show you guys something special. Now I be curious XD. <laughs> Demented! Worthy of reverence, an icon forged of ichor and gold. I'm sorry, what? We continue to upgrade the icon? Dear fuck, 50 bars of gold and 15 sin? This looks mortifying! Fucking mortifying! Oh, I just noticed a cute box. Here we go. All right, y'all, you're deciding my fate. I could honestly go out for a pretty good crusade right now, given how many hearts I have. Uh, those are Serenity and Grolf. I appreciate Road. <laughs> yeah, not a problem, Legal. You always do your best to support. No, I don't want to harvest sin. I want to get loyalty. You always do your do your best legal to try and uplift others. I want to do the same for you. You deserve just as you and everyone else here des deserve just as much love as you give. <laughs> God At damn it! Desk underscore VT, my character is hungry. Oh, your hair, your character hungry. Uh, what would be a good bit of food? You know what? I'm gonna treat y'all good. Huh. Huh. Also, I love how as soon as someone got revived, that happened. <laughs> Which is ironic since I'm making cookies. Ooh. Chat, resurrect a follower. Game, a life for a life. Basically, no take. <laughs> oh, the Vitoris. Want them back? La -da, la -da, la -da. <gasps> yes! 
Jalala! Ouch! Um... So, given their brother, Renor was given a new name, Stinky, as in, like, what they were given in the comic, what do we want to name Jalala? If we want to go on the same vein as... Janana? Nah. Well, I, I'm tempted to want to do something in a similar vein of, like, Stink. Like, because if their brother is named Stinky, I, I kind of want to go with a bit of a theme, but I'm not sure what. Also, dang, Janana. they are beat up. That... <laughs> That they they're smelly. <laughs> Sarah would probably say angel. <laughs> Sarah and Angel both are streaming right now. I will simply go. Sarah actually went to Hot Pot and I'm Jelly. Oh, Hot Pot's so good. All right, you know what? We'll do a combo of Janana and Smelly and do Smella. <laughs> Let's see. Unlawful sickly heals 15% slower. Impedible! Aww! Will break themselves and others out of prison! Ouch! I've been injured. Please send me to the healing bay. Another fucking death! Jesus fucking Christ! I take you in and you immediately flip in. I feel like season one Gary Oak saying smell a later. <laughs> Dag, um. Oh, that's another one from, uh, from the comic. Oh. Uh, excuse me, sorry to bother you, but on my journey here I lost my bag. It had a lot of precious mementos of my old home and I was wondering, maybe if you're not too busy, do you think you could find it for me? I lost it in Darkwood. Yes. Easy peasy, gives me an excuse to go out. Alrighty. It seems like we just milk uh, Lunaris and, and this whole bit until we get everything that we want. Because we almost have all the cards. Darkwood. We really hope that everyone has been doing well. If y'all have any news or anything that you want to talk about, feel free to talk away. No, not the hammer.
Gauntlets, yes. Being in Darkwood actually makes it easy for me to get, say, all these flowers. For when people inevitably get sick. <laughs> I don't think the game quite expected this. <laughs> oh, this is so good. This is so good. I, I need to get a screenshot. I need to get a screenshot! <laughs> as, the, as they're just screaming! I guess Drake feels vindicated. That was so good. Alrighty. I was not expecting that. <laughs> all right, gotta go all the way back down. Oh my word. I think oh. none of us did LOL. There we go. I ran right into that. There we go. Oh, looks like we got ads going. Uh, let's see. What would be good? Uh, probably here. Because then we can get a follower. Followers. Test for preparation. Oh, I can't have a simple one. All right, first wave. Here we go. Come here. I hope that folks had enjoyed a uh, stream yesterday, by the way. Because <laughs> while I wasn't expecting to do Horror Pool solo, I hope that I did. people liked that for like a little bit of a snippet on what's to come with Horror Pool. Oh, y'all are deciding my fate. And I still need to work on some NSFW for the last for the last time. Mm -hmm. 
Poison is dropped when attacking. Ooh. No, this might be a bad combo! I'm gonna have to rely on... Because at least my... It's my large attack doesn't cause um poison. All righty. Just boom. Can you tell I'm probably not the best shot? go. Take that. That was stupid. I thought I had space. Dumb. we go. Uh, we'll do berries. All right. Nice and simple. Let's just return home because I want to check on people considering people died. <laughs>
Thank you for the contribution. Oh, we're so close. For finding my sister, I'm glad she made it safe. Oh, I didn't find Jalala's bag. Fuck. I forgot. I need to go back. I need to go back. Gauntlets. Here we go. Now, if it'll tell me where the bag is, I would appreciate it. Oh shit, we're almost at an in-game year. That was nice. Just boom. See, I love when I'm at the point like this where I can just breeze the hell through. knows that I need flowers. Ooh, feather necklace. It's not giving me a spot to... Oh, this sucks. Well, I can at least go here for some blue hearts, even though there's not all that many. If there'll be any. Yeah, sorry, not sorry. I killed your friends. Oh, I should probably turn off the horror pool logo there. Okay. L losing red hearts means that you gain diseased hearts. All right, I gotta keep going through. Go north. Man, it's just giving me all the flowers. Just kind of goes. What? I hate these burrowers. And of course, someone died. Dagum. Ooh. Ooh. Yes, please. Oh, 
Alrighty, there we go. Guess we gotta go this way. Haha! -ha! Just boom, easy peasy. There we go. Sorry, I'm kind of hyper focusing on the game. <laughs> All right. Seems that we have to go through a second round in order to try and find the bag. people get ill now godly blunder bus ah uh, screw it i don't have the uh the effects so Boom. All right. Weapons. None of these are good. Oh, I forgot to cash this. As moody as. Ah! Just. Actually, I need gold nuggets. I can worry about sin later. Come on, let me go. There we go. Second round. Now, will it show me? I'll probably need to go to that question mark find the bag. Considering it doesn't want to tell me anything. <gasps> or boom. All right. Now that I have the bag. Boom. Easy peasy. That was six minutes. Wow. That felt simultaneously shorter and longer. Ten people. Wow. Gonna wait till it's daylight. The next egg will be golden. Ooh, we should probably have uh, some courting then, some point soon. All right, time to tend to the sick. Sorry, I love with with how much I love music, I always get engrossed with the melodies and stuff. Also, I have been making a lot more clothes as much as I can. So if there's other clothes that you guys want me to make, especially for your character, let me know. And I can swap uh, certain outfits out. 
Don't forget that tomorrow, Friday, we are actually doing uh, Kingdom Hearts as well. But that'll be a shorter stream because I work. Also, as a reminder, we do have the affiliate anniversary coming up on Sunday. Starting off with because I unfortunately work that day and my work refuses to give us any proper timing when it comes to knowing when things are well, when shifts are supposed to be. I unfortunately work that day until 6:37 ish, so Top Hat has agreed to start us off with um, his second attempt at an epic Mickey speed run on the Wii. So please be sure to give him some support because that supports our house and our polycule. Uh, haha. Let's see. Does need one more contribution. Stinky, how are you already old? Let, yeah, let's add you in, Renor. Actually, I don't know if you want to name uh, name them something new. Writes poems instead of working. Oh, that's fine. Very affectionate towards other followers. So you are the quintessential bard. Renor, you are a bard. You are henceforth a bard. Oh, you're at the center. Okay. I was wondering where the hell you, when the hell you would show up. Oh, you got a quest for me? You're so cool fighting against that scary guy. Nice. Okay. Oh, my back. I'm glad to have it back. Thank you very much. Actually, maybe you would like some of these? You've unlocked bonus comic images! Oh, hell yeah! Oh, let's go. I don't want to make people eat poo, no. I always get so concerned whenever I have the quest of like, hey, we should make this, th this person eat shit. I'm like, I'm sorry? Not enough. Gotta level you up. I think to like level ten. Alrighty. Oh! Alright, let's take the god tiers that we have up to here. And let's see what happens. Oh, now it's giving me four! And it's all... It's all... <laughs> necklaces! <laughs> Yep. 
Give me immortal, immortal, immortal. Damn. Are you telling me to give people more necklaces in my community? Uh, let's see. Who the- <laughs> You know what, legal? I shall, uh, gift you- Oh, you already have a necklace. Yeah, got it. Actually, while you're close by to folks, let me inspire. Aha! Here we go. Get those made. Gum it. Huh. Huh. Y'all gonna let me pick up the corpse? Oh boy. I think we're gonna need a few more resurrections soon. Also, we might want to have some nice little interactions. We'll do the one who waits with... Oh! Uh, let's see. Renor has the lustful trait. It's a two-thirds chance. You know what? They're NPCs. Let's go at it. Oh! No! Baby, I'm sorry! That was mean. Rejected. BIG REJECTION! DAMN! Like, that was cold! That was fucking cold! Just for that. Renor? Congratulations! You are the weakest link. Be subjected to sin. This TWW, no one cares who I am until I put on the crown. <laughs> all right, let's see all the ones that we can craft. We got the fancy rose, we have the drink tender vest that I've been wanting to make for a while. We have the jester costume. Obviously, we have nudist. 
uh, Renora's robes, we have Gothic dress, the uh, oh, yeoman's coat. Row. Oh, you want plant robe? You, you want the flowering frock? Yes, please. Okie dokie. Anyone else wanting any of these available ones that I haven't crafted yet? We have ceremonial robes. We have a maid dress. We have fancy robes. We have drink tender vest. We have gestures costume and four others that we haven't unlocked yet. You know what? I'll set up that. That one and that one. Yay! Alright, actually, what color do you want? Um, <laughs> do you want this notaic? This one, 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 and this one. Number two, please. Alrighty. Sorry, chicken stuff. All right, number two, and then a sign. Do no take. Where are you? Nice. We just need one What's more. On? <laughs> All kinds of stuff, Apple. We and we also just need one more totem for. Uh, one more contribution to the totem. Uh, I'm trying to think what else we can do right now before daybreak. You know what? So what happened earlier, uh, Apple, I don't know if you can hear right now, um, but I tried to have two NPCs have a kiddo, but they reject, um, Renor ejected, uh, rejected the one who waits, and the one who waits was sobbing. <laughs> I'll wait on sending folks out until later. Oh. It is later. All right, let's do... I'm tempted to do another brainwashing just so that I can get more materials and whatnot. Because if I do another brainwashing, do another fast, I can also do another resurrection.
Damn it that the ritual fast is on cooldown. All right, we'll just do the resurrection for now. We shall revive. No spoons. I redeem and lurk. All good. Uh, let's see. You know what? Just because it's so funny. Let's revive Kagi as a fucking alpaca. Oh. Let's see. No, I don't want stone. Damn. All right, at least we got something out of it. <laughs> at least I can sell the extra stone. And for this as well. Oh, someone leveled up. Oh, people just became close. Nice. All crops are fertilized. Yay! Thank you, because that also helps with the flowers. All right. Oh yeah, you have plenty of stuff. Buggy. I need to switch. At dusk underscore VT, you are not taking care of yourself, are you? I did not notice that you sent a full care package because I predominantly saw the <laughs> Uh, contributions for the totem, but thank you for the reminder, Apple. <laughs> Get my stretchies in. I can grab snackies in a bit. I'm tempted to do either... I have some, like, canned pears. Because that does sound good, actually. For, like, a little snack. Where are you? Foggy. There we go. I do have a drink right here as well. Yeah, thank you for the reminder on that. I am doing my best to take care of myself. Thank you for holding me to it. Inspire folks. No, that's not what I meant. It's not what I meant. Not what I meant. I was wanting to. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That was an accident. Why does it do that? Why does it do that? I don't want to bully. I am a good noodle. I am a good noodle. I want to be a good noodle. That poor follower. That was on accident. <laughs> All right, you know what? Drink your cares away, fuckers. I, I did a bad, so drink your cares away. Let's go.
Oh, yo, this is perfectly fine. Okay, Flarx befuddled. Actually, good idea. I'm getting my birthday wine. Ooh, nice. <laughs> there was this song. How did it go? Yeah. Ooh, nice. I'm not much of a drinker myself, honestly, because alcoholism runs on both sides of my family, and I'm pretty sure I inherited my dad's alcohol um, poisoning, actually, being allergic to alcohol. Because the last time that I tried to have alcohol, just like quarter of a shot in lemonade, my body was not having it. Is that why? Yup. People can actually have. I'm allergic to wine. People can actually have allergies to. The one who um, hates JS throwing hands. <laughs> Red wine. Yeah, people can actually have uh, allergic reactions to alcohol. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> I know and now I know W H H Y Y Y Y Y. Oh, Top Hat is cooking something. I can smell it. Excuse me. I'm more allergic to vodka, actually. Oh! Yeah, I had, with the, um, with, with the shot that, with the quarter of a shot that I had with, um, the lemonade that I had a few years back, it was vodka, and I had a really bad reaction. Similarly, when a friend tried to make me a, uh, Floridora, but really lighten, uh, the amount of alcohol that was in it, but I still had a really bad night. It sucks cause vodka and freaking everything. Yeah! You are not wrong I don't about drink that. For two reasons. Not really interested in it, and I don't want to know what type of drunk I am. No, I feel you with that. I could never get drunk enough to know what kind of drunk I am, and I think it's gonna stay that way. I already know what kind of stoner I am. I don't need to know what kind of drunk I am. <laughs> I know what I am. I'm a sleepy, and it only happened the first time. Ah! All right, now I can do this. Nice. Can I do any more rituals that would be beneficial here? All followers donate. Actually, that would be helpful. Fuck it, and I can send people out no for more bones. drinking for me, but a little every once in a bit helps with my endo. Oh! <sighs> Alright, now to send folks out. Or bones. All right.
Yeah, I don't have enough for more of those. Oh, there is nothing in the chest, apparently. All right, probably after th this night comes up, I'll do another round of like going through Darkwood at least so that I can get more flowers again. I'm also so tempted to rearrange how everything looks. You know what, Notaic, since you're up... Really? You're going to sleep there? Oh, do I have to manually assign you? What can I say? I'm a night owl. <laughs> Larg. Top hat. Free blood. Legally needs to stay away so that people can sleep. Or Lyria. Imogen. Rinka, Stinky, I'll put the siblings together, Stinky and Smella, Arambor, Notna, uh, Fitrano, No take, I already put you in a spot, I'm pretty sure. If not, Apple. Get everyone designated spots. Renor. Everyone moving in the middle of the night. Foggy. Ah. Yep, those three are on a mission, and we have plenty of spots left. Went from right side mid left bed to left side mid left bed. <laughs> Look, I don't want to be dealing with no one just like sleeping in the middle of the fucking convent. Uh, let's see. It's fair, just funny you chose same placing, different side, lol. Right, that was completely on accident. <laughs> I put pearl luster dust in my wine. Ooh. Who scream? Who did a scream?
Oh, wonderful leader. I wrote you a little something. Darkwood is green, Anora is orange, Anchor Deep is damp, and Silk Crater is... Um... Uh... Oh no. It's, it's not that good, is it? I need more practice. That you do. Interact. Inspire. Oh no, you tried to rhyme with orange. <laughs> Alright. Not in that again. Let's get you up to level 10 before I sacrifice you. Don't forget that there is a point redeem for y'all to be able to say stuff. Let's say the to say stuff in game. Yeah, they still don't like me. I'm sorry. Okay. I need so much more meat as well. I need swordfish. Let me double check to see if anyone's redeemed anything recently that I haven't fulfilled. Ritual I should do is actually the uh, the bounty. Oh, y'all are deciding my fate. Let's see if it's let's see if it's something good. Followers have become befuddled. Everyone's drunk! <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Where? 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 So much sick! Oh, this is funny. Tripped over the lamppost, causing it to collapse? Brilliant chat. <laughs> That'll leave him befuddled. <laughs> no shit! What do you, what do you? Where? There's so many people, it's hard to keep up. Fuck! <laughs> if it did not! <laughs> God damn it! Have you no shame, game? Have you no shame? 
At least they died partying like it was 69. Yeah, but apparently these fuckers can't take the look of a corpse and just three of them vomited in the same fucking spot. Jeez. All right, everyone seems good now. So let's check to see what we can get from... Staring at your cultist's corpse, they said the night will last forever. <laughs> let's see. Damn, it really loves to give me that one, doesn't it? Uh, you know what? Let's just start giving people gifts. Next page, give gift. Live twice as long. Increase loyalty. Increase movement speed. Sacrifice is key. Oh, I forgot I had that. Give you another gift. Have you have the missionary necklace as well? Interact. Inspire. Oh, they return! You, go sleep. Nice. You go rest. Oh. Well, the other three, I guess, are just gonna have to figure it out. Oh, wait. One of them is Nevertheless Noctis. Other one was. And a derp. Another one. Where are you? Alrighty, Dibby. If people want me to switch to a different game, I can. Because I know, like, I love that a lot of us love to lurk and I do love to have chill streams. I also know that some of us do like more interactive stuff. If we wanted to say swap to like Jackbox or something, we can. I know we haven't done Jackbox in a hot, hot minute. Oh, <laughs> no take! Why are you angry? Look at you! Interact. Um, give you a gift. Missionary. Oh. 
Not what I meant. I was wanting to inspire. That was a neat animation, though. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Notaic. I did a bad. Alrighty. Uh, let's see. Interact. Inspire. Um, give you a gift. What a hootifying experience. <laughs> Silly. The follower has increased demon level. Uh, actually, we'll do another missionary. Nor. Oh. Blessed Lamb, please listen to my poem. The leader is the best. They're super cool. If you don't think so, you're a fool. <laughs> It's not that good. I need more practice. <laughs> Interact. Inspire. Uh, not enough. Ugh, sorry, trying to stretch. Dude. Oh, and we got ads going. Go getting all the people. I already took confession just now. There we go. Actually, you know what? I will do a Pull super quick. Let me take a look at all the stuff that I have. Doesn't usually eat apple pie. Sees Genshin event with apple pie. Ooh. Me adds apple pie. Apple pie can be pretty nice, though. <laughs> Let's see. I'm gonna have... It can be just depends on place. I'm gonna have um, a poll going on for 10 minutes for stuff.
There we go. So I'm gonna have a poll going on for about 10 minutes if y'all want to answer that. I'm more of a coconut cream, pecan, or pumpkin pie guy. Pumpkin pie is so good. But I have a poll going on. I'm curious to know if you guys want me to like keep going with Cult of the Lamb tonight, or if you want to do something else, just because I know that it's kind of a low energy crowd tonight. Nothing wrong with that. I just want to be sure that I am reading the room and making sure that y'all are feeling respected regarding your boundaries and everything regarding stream. I. Oh, I need sin. Well. Uh, let's see. We'll do... Coggy, because why not? Speaking of pumpkin, my future sill actually baked me a pumpkin spice birthday cake last month. Nice! Alright. Now that I can do that, let's get people fucking. And I get Renor. Oh, now they have a better treat. Now they have a better chance. Let's go. Contemplating. Yes. All right. Very affectionate. We'll do that. Generates devotion twenty percent faster. <laughs> You know, I want to make, I will make them pettable. Oh. All right. Interact, make you sleep. Now, tend to the child. All right, I'm trying to think of all that can be done. Need to get ready for healing folks soon. See what I can get from this god tier. Yes, exactly what I wanted. All right. No, stinky. Y'all gonna let me fucking pick up the corpse? Thank you. 
Uh, let's put Leshy. All right, y'all, you're deciding my fate. I don't know what was in the spicy, but it complemented with with the cinnamon frosting. Ooh. Let's see. All right. It, I didn't see if you guys had done anything. I don't know if you guys did anything. <laughs> All right, let's. Oh, no, I'm now stuttering in text. Oh, no. <laughs> Which would be cuter? I might just stick with the... Mm, I'll do the normal color for that one. Do, 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 do. I need grapes! I thought I had grapes! Alrighty. Need to get ready to heal people soon. And of course people keep screaming. Already taking confession. Not a whole lot that I can do. <laughs> God. I did not want to touch that one, but it would a good it would be a good way for me to get rid of all, of all the excess poo that I have. <laughs> Cuz it uses 10. It uses ten. It uses 10 pieces of poo for each one. Oh, that would be so mean. Oh, I need to have a lot of flowers on standby. Yeah, because by the time that they wake up, everyone's going to be ill. Now I'm just gonna wait. Oh, and looks like the... Poll is almost done. Don't forget that y'all can um, like vote multiple times just using one extra oval. If you guys want to go hog wild, go for it. No one's stopping you except for yourself. Hey, do I have V-Sync on? Oh no, the V-Sync was helping. Okay. <laughs> it says zero, but you should be fine. Um, it's just my my system with Mix It Up is weird when it comes to the obols. All right, just biding my time. What does this even do? If the daily oval is more just like a daily little check-in that I that people can do if they want to like have like an idle interaction kind of sort of thing with stream. A A A A A. 
All right, we're sticking with Cult of the Lamb, it looks like. All right, and the faith went down. Let's heal everyone. I probably should have waited to do that ritual or the sermon. Oof. Trying to stretch. Hmm. Well, that was a bit of a glitch. Do, 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 do. do, 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 do. Sorry, wanting to check on a few things. Yeah. Let me get another person healed. Actually, looks like after Renor, just one more person. Not what I meant. Oh, I need to do a ritual. Get people happy. Um, we'll do a bounty. Yeah, catch double fish. I should have done that sooner. We'll just do a normal bonfire. Fuck it. That is a cute emote. I really ought to get some animated ones, but I don't know. I don't really have money to commission anyone to do anything animated, and I'm not good with animation myself. Thank you. Like, I'm legit curious on where you got that, because that is very adorable. Howdy, Jolly. Jolly! How you doing, love? Looks like the game audio is a little on the quiet side. I just noticed this whole time. <laughs> I'm gonna boost that a little bit. Sorry that took a while for me to notice. Of 
For those that may be hopping in to stream, maybe seeing my stuff, don't know what we do around here. Hello, this is the Road to Dusk. You can call me Road, Dusk, anything that you would call a friend. I'm a dream usher, focusing on sleep, dreams, and the imagination to create an environment where people can learn to be the better versions of themselves. We are currently doing some, uh, some cult maintenance in Cult of the Lamb. I'll probably do um, a few runs in Darkwood and a few other spots soon, but I just love to focus on like the uh, on the maintenance in the community. <laughs> I have no idea why. Let me reassure you, child. Don't forget that the point redeems are working in uh, congruence with Cult of the Land, so you can have your character say little fun messages, just keep them appropriate, and you can contribute to the totem. Still have quite a surplus of flowers, which is good. I'm trying to think of what else we can do right now, because I don't want to leave folks unattended. Ah, fuck it, they have enough food. Ah, uh, where do I want to go? You know what? I can go through here, because then it's just easy for getting grass, for getting flowers. <laughs> Surprisingly tired. I really hope that everyone has been doing well, by the way, though. I know this is kind of a low spoon night for quite a few of us. Myself included. See how far I can actually get. Because if I could go endless in here, I would. That's probably what Purgatory is for. <laughs> I need to use Purgatory a lot more. I'm just so used to having to go through this way. Because Purgatory actually, thankfully, doesn't um, make you. Like, doesn't make you lose time. Ah, uh, let's see. Oh, I need the grapes, actually. So I will take that. Oh, nice. Got some random meat.
Oh, y'all are deciding my fate. Uh, do not forget that we do have the affiliate anniversary coming up on Sunday. Um, there is also an optional donathon with a giveaway for uh, $250 worth of art from me. If you want in on the action, you can type in exclamation point Kofi to get in on early on that. Every 10 bucks is an entry for the giveaway. And I believe there is something very, very special for getting us to some of the higher tiers. Uh, we'll go this way. No hammer. Blunderbuss. Oof. Let's see how far I can go. Hopefully no one dies while I'm out. And watch, because I said it, it's going to fucking happen. Weapons, let's see. Ah, uh, none of these are as are quite what I'm looking for. Here we are. Barbados. Second round. I haven't heard nobody die yet. Really hope that everyone has been doing well, by the way. I know we're kind of low energy tonight. But, ooh, there we go. Darn, it came all up this way just for it to be the wrong path. Let's go this way. Nice. There we go. 
All right. Get all the money. Uh, now let's see. Because going this way would also help me to... This would be good for a fall door because then I can still get grapes. Oh, you're sickly. This one doesn't look tasty. You can have for free. Nice! Just a little sickly. I can take care of them. As they are perpetually in a state of basically existence and non-existence waiting for me to pull them in. Thank you for letting me ransack your shit. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we'll do a normal one. <laughs> I was not expecting to be able to do that while that was still going. Asshole. Alright. What do we have here? The hell is this? Fuck you too. And again, this is also the easiest part of the map. As I get hit. Thank you so much for the follow! Huh, let me be sure that... I can give you a proper shout out. Shane! Thank you so much for the follow! Really appreciate it. For those that are hopping in and don't know what we do around here, this is the Road to Dusk. You can call me Road, Dusk, anything that you would call a friend. I am a dream musher focusing on sleep, dreams, and the imagination to help create an environment where people can learn to be the better versions of themselves. We're currently doing some Cult of the Lamb, where I love to prioritize doing a lot of stuff related to like the community and just generally having a spot where people can hang out and do silly stuff. Uh, and yeet. Yeah. As a reminder, we do have our two-year affiliate anniversary going on. Uh, let me pull up the info for that, actually. For those that do not know, December, tw December, September 22nd, this Sunday, starting at noon Eastern. So that'll be about 5 p.m. Um, for like Britain and Ireland, six, I believe for Germany. Um, and then like four, uh, it's like 11 a.m. Uh, U.S. Central, 10 p.m. U.S. Mountain, and 9 p.m. U.S. Oh shoot, sorry. QWQ. Let me know when the ads are done. Ah. Uh. 
Sorry, just wanting to be sure that everyone is listened to and taken care of. Dude. Please remember to server within 15 minutes. I'll post the Discord server while we wait. Please remember to verify you've read the rules for the server within 15 minutes of hopping in three. Alrighty. Since you requested that, I will turn off the TTS. Uh, the TTS was originally on, but yeah. So um, I'm I'm assuming that with you having the TTS uh, redeem, you are done with ads, Shane. I will note uh, for those that are listening in and given the uh, link that I put in for our Discord server, do know that like uh, my streams here, our community is 18 plus. We are LGBTQI2 Spirit Plus, Neurodiversion, Disability, and Mental Health Forward. We also do our best to support and uplift BIPOC voices regarding their own experiences. Uh, that said, oh, got me doing some squats and twists. All right, I will be doing those while I am talking about the affiliate anniversary. So, like I said earlier, we are having our two year affiliate anniversary with a few special little perks. We have a giveaway going on in congruence with an optional donathon. Um, the donathon is namely because living in corporate and capitalistic America these days as a disabled low income person is a whole bunch of bullshit. Because needless to say, our, uh, my hours and my work is very inconsistent lately, especially with it being the fall. So I have no way to basically have a stable income, even despite the fact that I have to have full-time availability for part-time hours, and they can't even give me the hours that I need. So, unfortunately... I need help trying to fortify a savings, especially for the winter, because I cannot trust my work to give me stable income right now. But with that, there's going to be plenty of incentives for you guys should you support me financially in any of this. Um, there are individual incentives. Um, One dollar makes me have to learn a song. Five bucks means that you get a shout out for the remainder of the donathon which will be 24 hours if you want the shout out to be for someone else please be sure that you have consent and i forgot to write this but please be sure that they are 18 plus as well uh 10 bucks you will get a free chibi sketch from me 25 bucks you'll get three free emotes 50 bucks you will get a free half body commission from me 100 dollars you will get a free video edit from my from my nesting partner top hat uh, over 125, you get to choose a future stream. In regards to the giveaway, the giveaway is for $250 worth of value of either streaming assets or general art from me, as I am an artist, and it's $10 per entry. We are currently 45 bucks in, and we are almost halfway to our first goal in our first tier, where at $100, the Theta Balls, as in myself and my system, because I'm dissociative, and my nesting partner, Top Hat, will play the inscription card game when we get our copy in March. 
at 150 bucks, we will have an eight hour retro game night because I have a physical PS2, GameCube, and a few other bits that I can mess around with. 200 will mean an eight hour Final Fantasy 14 stream, so a good bit of speed running to try and get through a good portion of the game again. $250 and 500 in the second tier will mean special hints regarding a new arc that my system and I have planned for the summer of next year. And you'll notice that tier three, at least tier three, is considered locked. If you want to know more about these tiers and have them unlocked, we need to get to $350 uh, for the Donathon if you guys are curious. If you guys want to be in on the action regarding that and get an early uh, get an early start on the uh, Donathon, feel free to check out the Kofi. It is not mandatory. It is I, I want to emphasize that even though my financial situation is not the best, please prioritize yourselves and this is being considered optional. There are plenty of other things that we have planned. Whether we get the financial uh, stuff or not, things are some stuff is still going to happen. Not all that we have planned as the tiers and goals, but some stuff will happen. And in the end, this is all meant to also reward you guys and respect you guys for your time, your effort, and your support. So if any of that is of interest to you, please feel free to stick around. I would very much appreciate the company. Yeah, I do my best to do uh, good art. Everything here on stream, except for the little dragon above me and my Life 2D model, is made by me. I made my logo, I made the overlay, I made my little chat box, and you'll also notice that sometimes it switches to English and in another language. Yes, I also have a conlang. All right, let's get to this person. Or, well, person, gonna be a creature for me to have to fight. Ah. Here we go. Oh no, I woke it up. There we go. Up. <laughs> I don't remember that happening before. As a reminder, I hope you guys are excited for um, October for... I would love to try and figure out a good title for like the month of October for like related like scares. I might call it like Scarefest, but I'm pretty sure a festival already has that name and would probably trademark strike me. But I am planning some special stuff for October, namely playing Alice Madras Returns and Spirit Camera on the 3DS. Because my 3DS is actually currently being modded with a capture board so that I can actually do stuff. So I am very excited for that. Oh, still, my heavy attacks are still unavailable. Okay, not in that reached old age. Okay. And I wasn't paying attention on what became of the map. Here we go. I just realized that uh, some of those emotes were uh, Iron Bows. I, I, I have no idea who does her emotes, but they're always so cute.
Here we go. There we go. Oh, ha ha. Oh. Also, I will forewarn for any newbies. I do curse a decent bit. I am a little too focused on the game to do that quite this moment, but it does happen. Because I am trying not to die. Because I am now out of blue hearts. Here we go. Come here. Ah, uh, let's see. We'll go down this way, because then I can get another follower there. Get a diseased heart, because that's the best thing I can do. Let me get... child. How many layers have I gone through? Is this... I have lost track already. Alright, now that he's gone... Oh, I forget their pronouns, actually. Now that they are gone... Let's ransack in here. To get some extra meat. And then boom. Camellias. Oh, uh, and we've had our first death. Well, as soon as I am done going against the next disciple, I'll go back. Well, which, hey, it's right here. For beta second. go get some sin because I'm gonna need a bit of that let's go back oh you can only go two layers apparently no I did three layers I did three layers I was not <laughs> 
I was not focusing on that. Damn. That took me by surprise. Let's see, how bad are the numbers now? Yay, I've returned. Let's give people a sermon. All right, y'all are deciding my fate. Let's make it a good one. Y'all brought a y'all brought a member back. Let's go. Thank ya. Child. Born of original sin. All right. Who wants to name this little child? It is pettable and it is lustful. What is it? Uh, good question. It's, it's some sort of little amalgam. So kind of hard to say. <laughs> Blobby? Oh, I see Grogu. <laughs> nah, it's gotta be green if it's gonna be named Grogu. I'll do Blobby for now. Because I believe when it is an adult, we can actually change its form and its name again. Now. Baby. Into the nursery. Oh, I love how the music changes when you have a child. Y'all hadn't eaten? Man, and I thought my ADHD ass was bad. Really hope that everyone's having a good time, by the way. Have a ritual that made us fast. Oh, true. I thought that had uh, gone away by the time that I had left. And I'm having a good time because you're having a good time. Having a good time. I'd like to get a tiny lobotomy. <laughs> Let's not and say that we didn't. Lobotomies are so scary. Lobotomies are such a barbaric practice. <laughs> like I, I i love me some good like no thoughts head empty just not giving a shit oh not as a sleeper too or a snorer daggum So let's make a new bed for, we'll put this, no, we can't have the snorers next to each other. So we'll have, not in the, have a special bed here. There you are. 
No kidding, but I would like the little ass had akin to Judge Frollo on my brain that is tormenting me today to... No. <laughs> Uh, are you meaning poetically, or do you actually have an interject of Claude Frollo? Sorry, me being dissociated, I'm like, wait, do I take this seriously, or do I take this, like, jokingly? I mean, who else would be a Machiavellian, would be Machiavellian enough to treat me like Quasimodo? Oh, that is, that is a mood. No, I, I can empathize with Hostiles considering we have fucking Lark scene. <laughs> Then my brain plays Hellfire. <laughs> I mean, it, it, it's a good song. Musically, I love it. More Kingdom Hearts shit. <laughs> oh yeah, no, we have a lot of folks in our system that are interjects from Kingdom Hearts. Like, Kagi in our system is actually originally a Kingdom Hearts OC. <laughs> Had a fucking Keyblade and everything. So, like, playing Kingdom Hearts games is a combo of memory lane, nostalgia, and for some of us, a little more than others. Love what he's sass in Kingdom Hearts 3. Oh, I'm looking forward to getting to Kingdom Hearts 3, like playing it for you guys on stream. Because after I finish up, I'm wanting to go somewhat chronological for the series. Currently, I'm on two. After that, I want to do Recoded. Then after that, I will do uh, three five eighties over two. Then after that, I will get to three since we can't do anything for um, like, say, Union Cross, and plus I'm pretty sure um, Square Enix wouldn't like it if I just showed back cover. Which chronologically? Uh, the Kingdom Hearts series. At least chronologically when it comes to the inner story. Oh wait, fuck! I still need to do Birth by Sleep! Fuck! <laughs> I keep forgetting about birth by sleep! Have you seen the aqua pinball? I have not actually. Would you mind sending me it? Nurture the child. I mean, story chronologically or release date, but I think that just answered my question. Yeah, I mean, if I was going to do properly chronologically, I should have done Birth by Sleep first rather than Kingdom Hearts 1. I need to do Birth by Sleep soon. Oh, wait, the Aqua Pinball? It is in Birth by Sleep. Okay. So I don't remember the pinball when I played Birth by Sleep. Then again, Technically, while I have played Birth by Sleep, I have not been able to complete it. Namely because my PSP is dead. I have to replace the battery. I've had a physical copy of Birth by Sleep with a Birth by Sleep 
PSP this entire time, but I am too goddamn poor to get the battery replaced for me to fucking play it. <laughs> it's in Minnie's world. Okay. Just everyone going, huh? Here we go. Uh, let's see, how much food do you guys have? Not a whole lot, okay. Just give y'all grass. Wait, was that enough? No. Have you tried explaining the difference between good lighting and bitchy lighting? What, what do you mean by that? I've never heard things being referred to as good lighting and bitchy lighting. Let me do a quick save. Light me. Oh, light. Wait, lighting zap zap? Are we talking about Lark scene? I'm confused. <laughs> Good lighting, good lightning says good chow, bad lightning says, uh, good. okay. <laughs> I saw lighting, not lightning, so I was like, wait, what? Lightning's, uh, lightning. <laughs> oh, good, just got confused for a moment there. Uh, let's see, what are my resources? Oh, I got plenty of flowers. I could actually do another brainwash if I can. Yeah, like S Sora's lightning versus Larxene's. Oh, okay. Hmm. I'll have to think on that while the ads are going. Now it's just you, me, and those wall of ads which put between us. <laughs> Alright, so when it comes to asking, like, what's the difference between like Sora's lightning and Larxene's lightning? I element-wise, I would say there's not really a difference. Um, namely because just cause Elements magic doesn't really lean onto what is good or bad. It's more of the user. So whether like we can't really say whether Sora is better or Light Scenes is better. Lightning is just lightning. Magic is just magic. You could probably argue that um you could probably argue that simply because Sora has the Keyblade and everything and has more expansive magic that his is more powerful, but that's the best thing that I could say. Random followers have been cursed. It looks different too, plus his is a different color. Oh, I would have to double check on that. I have to look back on... um the times that I've played uh, Chain of Memories.
Yeah, I'll definitely have to take a look at that because now you got me curious. Nope, okay. All good now. His kind of forms like a ball, whereas Larxene looks like she stole it from from Stormy and Wings Club. Oh my god, I have not heard about Wings Club in a good minute. Oh, oh, let's go. That is a blast from the past. Damn. I forget, do I have... Not enough! I told you! Renor... Yeah. Yarnmer? Oh! Okay. Not enough? Unavailable. Orchids... Oh boy. I... Oh. You were probably going to... But was it just me, or was it more palatable to watch, um, like the PAL dub or like the uh, the other English dub compared to Four Kids? Like, sure, some of the songs uh, from the Four Kids version, like Mean Girls, Rye, yes, Rye English, yes, I could do with that so much better than the Four Kids one. <laughs> Oh wait, I had a second one. I also haven't bothered to touch the Nickelodeon redub for it. I hear that people say it's good, that it's a lot better than the 4Kids version. And it's probably going to be better than the Rye version, because even I have my gripes with uh, the Rye dub. But still. I miss Martin miss I heard that was a good one too. Oh yo, who remembers Huntick? Yeah, it's good it just personally was only exposed to the four kids version. Also, it's hard to try and get into the series when they screw it up so bad after season four. Agreed. And I heard that the remaster that they're doing right now, the reboot, is not all that great. Like, I, I kind of loved season five because it was cool to have um, a fairy of Earth with Roxy, but things could have been so much better, especially with with the Winx Club as adults. Thank you for the stretchies, by the way. When the girls are adults, why do they still have to act like high schoolers and be in such bullshit arguments, especially with their partners? Huntick, that was a blast from the- oh, hell yeah. Hell, hell yeah. Have you seen the outfits? I've seen more controversies with the reboot with the fact that they apparently did Musa dirty. Uh, a lot of people are upset with the fact that with Musa originally meant to be um, a representation of like the Asian girls, they kind of took away the Asian aspects of her uh, physicality, and especially, especially her face structure, and some people are concerned about that. Actually, wrote it gets worse in the OG comics. Alfia is a college. They were college kids, but in the fucking. I would have so loved if it, if they actually kept it as a college rather than the fucking TV series turning it into a high school. Why did they have to turn it into a high school then if it was originally a fucking college? If it was originally a fucking uni, come the fuck on!
I also actually did not know that Wings Club was originally a comic before it was adapted to TV. That is neat. That is very, very neat. Sadly, I know a few college peeps that didn't let go of their high school days. I mean, define on what you mean by that, though, because it's like, I was like, I think it's a translation issue that they never fixed, but I found it out on the OG website in the 2010s. Wait, so even in the Italian version, these girls are college? Shit. Looks like I'm probably gonna need to pick up Italian in order to be able to get a proper sense of the fucking series. Jesus Christ. Leave it to American uh, translators and localizations to fuck things up again because they worry about American censors. Pretty much act like high schoolers. Mmm. I think it's pretty much the same, but different context. Ah. Are there any other rituals that I can do? Oh, I can do a sermon. But wow. Wow, wow, wow. Oh, right. I'm gonna do the ocean's bounty because that'll let me get more fish. I have to ask, why did a localizer think it was okay to throw all that trauma at high schoolers? Uh, probably because in American culture, abuse and neglect, especially in families, is so much more common that what better way to just consider it a uh, normal circumstance than to just casually put it onto what they want to consider high schoolers for a show. Because if I seriously had a nickel for any time any friend or former friend of mine, or of my system and I's, was in an abusive household, I would be beyond fucking rich. You want another nickel? I mean... <laughs> that is- that is completely up to you! <laughs> Plus, my whole circumstance of where my sister and I were raised was in the American Midwest, which is just the South Light. It is the Bible Belt Light. People love to go off like, oh, the Bible Belt is, uh, like what is uh, related to the, um, the American South because of the high amount of, of Christianity and whatnot there. That, but also I would say the Mississippi River is an extension of the of the uh, the Bible Belt and by proxy the Ohio River, which uh, connects to the Mississippi. Oh God, I got the full South. Yep. Oh, I got part South because my because uh, our father is Floridian. Don't live there no more, but you can take the you can take the boy out of the South, but you can't take the South out of the boy. Hey Zelda, hope you're doing well.
Texas is the Bible Belt buckle, and those rubbers you mentioned are the belt hoops. Yep. Always doing well when, when you're around. Glad to hear it. Sorry, someone had requested a TTS to be off. If people do want it back on, uh, there is a redeeming, that there is a redemption that you can do, uh, which is only like, what, 10 obols? So it's pretty inexpensive because it's predominantly meant to be an accessibility feature. Oh, I'll have to read yours no take in a bit because I'm curious. If I had a nickel for when I was in a discussion about localizers throwing trauma at high, sc high schoolers, I'd have two nickels, which isn't a lot, but it's interesting that it happened twice. <laughs> I mean, also, isn't the whole thing of, like, thrusting high schoolers into trauma just the majority of anime? I, I said what I said. My... My family just got back from uh, back home from eating out, and before that, we went to church. So my mom was getting married. Okay, in order uh, married out in order to help get things prepared. Well, hey, glad everything went well, Zelda. Oh, Apple, considering you're also a bit of a, a Kingdom Hearts nerd, I recently had a thought of a potential discussion that I may want to have at some point, whether in like whether in like DMs with some folks or as like a video. And I kind of want to know your thoughts on the matter. Just in case like I'm like potentially going too far or if I'm like, stretching myself too thin with something. Oh, looks like y'all are deciding my fate. While y'all are doing that, I will send you what I have been working on, Apple. Alrighty, Daddy. Nurture the child and clean up your shit. I'm gonna have to revive not enough for this to work out. Actually, you're level what? Oh, level nine. I'll pet you. Oh, I barely did a level up. Inspire. Ah, yes, level 10. Now, I shall set forth and I forget, can I die and be revived in purgatory? You know, I will not risk it. 
actually. If it's a sacrifice... Sacrifice of the flesh. Sacrifice of follower. Yep. If someone sees that out of context, I'm gonna be fucked. <laughs> ha ha! There you are, my friend! Back! Stay back! I will slice your belly open! I will cut that crown from your head! What foul place is this? Moments ago, I was. I was. Ha <laughs> ha ha! And you are old. Walks into the street, kill him! Hi, Speed! Hi, Speed! How you doing? Doing good, how about you? I'm doing pretty good, I'd say. We shall give you... Oh. You're just here. I can't do anything with you. We shall inspire. 10 out of 10. Good, good. <laughs> Hope y'all are having a good time, by the way. We'll be going for about another hour. Child? Okay, you're not out of the cage. Wait, how... Really, all of that fishing and I didn't get a whole lot? Damn. Anytime with you is a good time. Well, I'm glad to hear it, Zelda. <laughs> really hope that everyone enjoyed uh, last night with uh, Parasite Eve, honestly. I'm hoping to want to do more with uh, my PS2 and PS1 games. Especially since I can use how much that I spent on getting the new PS2 as a tax write-off. Having a good time. Spoons are slowly getting restocked. Glad to hear it. Let me in. Hi, Star. Give me a quick moment. Let me also be sure that people can hear you first thing. What, where are you, hun? I got the story to share. Well, hop in the VC, chica! You do understand I needed those words to come out your mouth before I hopped in, right? <laughs> what, you gotta be a flippin' vampire in here? Speaking of vampires... <laughs> oh, no, no! <laughs> now that's supposed to... Okay, so... I think I've told you right before that I'm doing D and D. Yes. With Doxy. Yes. You do know Doxy, right? Doxy, yeah. Doxy baby. Yeah. Haven't talked. Yeah, ha my DM. yeah, haven't talked with Doxy in a hot minute, but yeah. She's my DM. They are so fucking fun. Anyway, point being, we we this this is session number ten. Woo. Yeah, it, it, it would be a lot more sessions, but there is a lot of shit that happened in between all that. It's complicated. We don't need to go into details. Anyway, the point being, 
is this is session number 10 mm -hmm. this has been the most fun session and you mentioned vampires so ironically that's what one of my story is because ah. uh, yeah no so just a quick recap basically our we, our party right now is phase Ooh. we have a fairy and owl 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 and bear an owl bear <laughs> It, yes, it's an owl bear, but it's they're actually yeah, it's an owl bear because they're an owlin that was turned into an owl bear. It's an interesting uh... thing. But we we found we found her in the Fey Wilds, and she follows. She's with us now. She she lives she lives with our party. Aww. Yeah, she she just decided she's like I like this changeling and this fairy. I'm gonna follow you now. Nice. So you now we now have an owl bear, owlin, owl, owlin in our party. Nice. The thunderclap. Yeah. And we have to constantly tell her do not, do not, do not. There's times where you can and times where you can't. Don't. <laughs> she's adorable. We love her. We 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 absolutely fucking love her. Right. She's adorable. But anyway. So. To summarize, it's like we started out in the Feywilds. We moved into because this is a homebrew, so yeah. it's like the place is it has its own thing. But we basically moved to an orc town. We did some things there for a little bit, and then that led us to go from orc town to across the sea to uh, like a snowy region. Right. And we were ta when we got there, we were tasked with like okay. We're actually questing for a very specific... The reason we went there is because we're trying to hunt down a very specific metal that can be used to turn... Uh, that can be used to become a weapon. Uh, right. For... What specific, like, specifically killing, like, devils, demons, etc. So there's a high speed... Speed! Oh. But yeah, we're, we're actually... So th that's what started this whole thing off. We were actually, like... On the hunt down for this specific metal. However, we were told, well, you can get it, but you gotta do a favor to get it. Of course, you, you oh. we're not just gonna give it, you have to earn it. So they're like, okay, but where is it? They're like, all right, it's here, and we'll get you passage to this snowy region. However, when you get there, you're going as our ambassadors. You're tasked to meet up with the chief of this specific village that you're gonna be living in. And you're going to help people there. And as you help them, once they've deemed you worthy enough and you've kind of, you know, done your job as ambassadors, you will then have earned the right to get this medal that you seek. Hmm. So our peers are like, all right, bet. We traveled across the ocean. I fucked the sailor. While traveling across the ocean. And, um... We got to our new home. We've been there for a while, and then while we were there, we're like, hey, so, all right, we've helped you guys, you know, we rescued some kids in a mine. We helped you, to, like, kill a succubus. I got to keep her horn as a trophy. Um, we found you a, a well with, um, uh... goodness gracious, but holy water. Hmm. So, so it's like we've helped you with the mine. We helped you find a source of holy water, which we get first dibs to because we cleared out the succubus guarding said holy water, and we've done all this stuff. What else can we do? So like, well, you can either help us out around the village and just earn some money as like an odd jobs type of thing, or you can help out in the city. That leads us to where we are now. In the city, we found people talking about rumors of people going missing and allegedly connected to vampires. Ooh. So we're like, okay, what's the job? They're like, well, we have rumors, but rumors aren't information. So what we need you guys to do is essentially hunt down any information, see if there's any truth to the rumors, etc., etc. And if there is, then we need you to find out, you know, what the fuck's going on. Hmm. And yeah, Apple, if you want to send references uh, for what I sent you, because I am tempted to make it into a video, please do. I would very much appreciate it. Oh. But yeah, so that's what happened. Uh, 
Oh, that's right. Yeah, my character is a changeling bard. Ooh, okay. Who the, the way think of him this way. My character is a changeling bard whose personality is if the Cheshire cat and Loki had a love child. Nice. Yes. So they that's what they do. Um and somehow my character has also somehow become the key wrangler of this group of insane motherfuckers. <laughs> I'm a key jingler in, in real life, and apparently my character has also been, <laughs> become the key jingler. But also the impromptu leader. I somehow ended up becoming the leader of the group. But I'm like, how the f did this- Y'all put the changeling bard as the leader of this group? <laughs> this- because- it, it, it wasn't like we had set up to- it just ended up having- and they're like, you know, you're the leader, and I'm like, how? How did this happen? Why is my character <laughs> suddenly the responsible one? They're the chaotic being! How did they end up the responsible one? <laughs> because... So... Uh, because... That, that just sounds so ironic. Yeah, that's I was like, oh my god. Our fairy is an artificer. Ooh! Who's a hermit. And had to get dragged out of her home in the Feywilds by my character, who is her childhood friend. Hmm. So that's the, like, that's their history, because like I said, the, we, we knew each other, we just found our owlbear. Right. But we've known each other since childhood, but because of that, we have a connection, so, like, to the point where the fairy in the party is the only one who actively knows my character's fey name. Oh, which, yeah, like, I'm like, like, if you have a fey name, you know that they don't give that shit out. Mm-hmm. And if they do, they only give it to trusted people. Yeah. <laughs> so, he, she knows his fey name, or their fey name. Nice. And vice versa, she, they, they know hers. Oh. Yeah, so they're really close friends, but the only way they got their mother is like, look, I, if you come out of the woods, I will buy you food and drink. And that's how they got out of the house and got into the... That's how they ended up on this little journey. Um, but... Yeah, they, they... While they were in town and stuff, they ended up finding clues like, okay, there might actually be some truth to this. By the way, you know how they found out that there was some truth to the rumors? Oh... They got invited... Yeah, my character right. got invited to be a part of a cult. Ooh. Yeah, because they, they were asking around clues like, Hey, anybody know anything about the occult? Things like that. Anybody seen anything weird? Et cetera, et cetera. Da -da 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 -da. And that prompted a cult leader to be like, Hey. It, think of like Resident Evil 4, like just like, what are you boy and stranger? <laughs> Except they just slipped them a note and was like, if you want to know more, here you fucking go. And they walked <laughs> off and it's like, okay, random stranger in the city handing me a note telling me to come join a cult. <laughs> and um, we rolled. Doxy had us roll to see what kind of cult it was. You were <gasps> never going to guess what kind of cult it is. Was it a vampire cult? No. Was it an MLM? It was a lawful good cult. Oh. Huh. Yeah. That's what Doxy said. They're like, huh? I'm like, huh? What do you mean, huh? And then they're like, you guys know what kind of cult you rolled? And we're like, what? They're like, it's a lawful good. And we're like, what the fuck? <laughs> so what you just came fuck? across a bunch of hippies then? They were basically people who were going around town wearing masks and just doing good. They were like a, like a, Vigilantes, almost. Neat. Yeah, but I was like, well, I was not expecting that with a cult, but hey, you right. know what? That's fine. But the, they, because of this cult, they tipped us off and like, hmm, you know, I, I haven't seen anything, but I've definitely heard rumors kind of confirming it. You might want to try checking out here. Hmm. Then the party decided as a group, all right, let's 
Let's check it out again. There's nothing gonna be. Because again, the whole quest was just to find out information. They didn't know if there was a truth to it or not. So they literally just go find information and we'll basically pay you for all the information to find. And that information. Our quest ended up leading us to a tavern that was also doubling as a brothel. Mm. So it was in there that we're like, okay. This seems to be like the epicenter of information, so let's find out. Hijinks ensued, and but thanks to said hijinks and some really bad rolls on my end, uh, we found our vampire. Ooh. Yep. And uh, they're a very perceptive vampire because they figured out that my character was a changeling. Oh. Well, snap. And they came up to us and yeah, they. They they came up to us and they're like, hmm, you know, I uh, don't see very many changelings out here. And they're like, excuse? Excuse? Pardon what? <laughs> but um, I rolled a 20. Like at the end, because Doc was like, okay, it, it's near the end of the session, roll 20. Between the combined, like all the information that we found as a party, as a whole, what I found out in the tavern, and all this other stuff, and everything that we put together, Doc's like, You found your vampire. No, nice. we didn't have, like, yeah, like we as a player, we we suspected it because we were like, This this guy, this guy is like, mm, mm, mm. Mm. <clears throat> but uh, as the character, we don't have any proof, proof, so this session. We're like, all right, the vampire just left with two women on his arm. Where do we go from here? Right. We're like, all right, time to follow him. That's where we left off last session. So this session, we actually successfully managed to not only sneakily follow him, we also managed to, like, we managed to get a uh, follow him to where he would see he was getting a carriage, and then follow him all the way out of the city without oh. him noticing. Oh. And be, but here's the thing, everyone's like, oh, you're, you're a changeling. I was like, where is this going? I was like, well, they know what we look like, but you, um, like, ugh, message received. You know, like, message received, I get it, you want me to. Right. So, I did, I, I shifted, and I literally got in. Nice. I got in the house without raising any suspicion. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I literally was let in and everything. Like, all right, I'm in. And I, all of my rolls tonight were fucking. Up. I had two dirty twenties. Dang. On some really critical rolls that I really needed them on. I was about and to say, was two... this was this like um, Flara getting so many nat twenties that one night? No, no, Flara was getting nat twenties. I got two dirty twenties. Fair. <laughs> I did get I did get one nat twenty though. Ooh. And that was like right out the gate starting off for my stealth check, I, I rolled a nat twenty. Oh that is awesome. Yeah, I was like, we needed to follow this vampire, we did it. Fucking nat twenty, let's go. Hi Mishka, give me a moment, you pesky little thing, I will be with you shortly. <laughs> is she being a menace? Yes, she wants mommy's attention. To be fair, this was a longer session than normal. Like, we went almost five hours. Uh, we normally only do, like, three to half to, like, all four. Right. We have a child. Let's rename and reform the child. Oh, no, we can't change their form. Damn it. All right, do we want to no, rename the child at least? Wait a minute, is this me and Tobias's child? No, this is a whole new child. Because me and Tobias have had two children already so far. Nope, this is not your child. <laughs> Where is my baby? They're they're around. They better not be fucking dead, bro. <laughs> I have two children, and they, they better not be fucking dead. But do, if they are, do you need me to like put the immortal necklace on them so they don't die? Better fucking do that. They are my children. <laughs> All right, I, I, I see Bill. We're going to name them Bill. <laughs> I was the daddy for one of them. Uh, we'll name, we'll name Star's butter. next child Butter. We are not naming the... No! 
<laughs> you already have one butter. You're not getting another one. <laughs> oh yeah, I am under pressure because in my Pokemon Nuzlocke, I have freaking uh Spee slipped into the chat. I didn't notice it was Spee. They were, they, so they, I had a Charmander and she named it fucking Butter. And I was like, wait a minute, why does Spee know about Butter? And I was like, oh, oh. Oh, that's good. And now I have no choice but to keep Butter alive. So Butter can't die because otherwise Spee will kill me because Butter has passed. But butter is still alive. But, um. But yeah, oh, vampire. I'm almost done with the vampire story. So, yeah, yeah. Got to the vampire's house. The other two stayed outside. They had no idea they were there. And now I have to find a way to punish the fairy. Oh. She got me. Oh. She went into the window oh. while, I, like, while everyone was gathered around, including the vampire. Sitting at the table and sat in the window, and my character was like, Damn. Why? <laughs> So I had to pretend not to notice, but of course, she's sitting in the window, and everyone's gathered around, so they're all like, Huh. Right. And I was like, And the vampire's like, I know that fairy. So you want to tell me why you're here again? And I'm just like, It's like, I'm not taking it. There was, there was 12 women in the house and like six kids. Wow. We we were there was three of us. If we started a fight, we were not winning. We were not walking out of that fight. We were not walking out of that house alive. Right. So and I had to play it off. And then the vampire's like, you know what, just invite your friends. And I was like, sure, might as well. We're, we're already here. Let me bring them in the house. So <laughs> we brought them in. And, but you know, we're already sus of this dude. Mm-hmm. We're trying to get the suspicion off of us, so we're like, mm, we, I keep calling them human. So it's like, oh, you know, I haven't interacted with humans much, so you're kind of just like a curious little human. Mm. In a house full of women that aren't all the same species, that are like, they're all different races. Yeah, so, you know, what's, uh, what's, what's going on here, buddy? <laughs> But like we made a casual conversation and my my poor my poor little changeling While we were having a discussion away from all the women, you know how like when women are really curious or anybody's really curious and like trying to like eavesdrop in on the conversation. Yeah, yeah, yeah uh, My character basically was like, oh I was curious about humans, but also, you know What's uh, what's your riz like, my man? Like, how do how, how you do it? It's so uh, <laughs> they overheard the entire conversation, <gasps> and we're just like, yeah, because I was playing, I was playing it off. They had to play it off because they'd be like, this is why we're right. curious. And, but then they were laughing, and my guy was just like, just don't react, don't say anything, don't do nothing. There's just, just you don't hear this. Meanwhile, this pride is shattering because a house full of women just heard. A changeling coming in because hey um you know I, I i see that you have all this risen going on you've got these two mm -hmm. women and that made me kind of like wonder about like how do you do it what's your secret especially with you being human and these are different races so they're trying to figure out my deal but also doxy made it very clear they're like yeah, they're trying to figure out, like, oh, is this really why you came out here? And are you some kind of incel? And my poor guy is just like... <laughs> they called you an incel? <laughs> no, that was Doxy at the DM. Is the, You know how, like, Doxy can speak for the NPCs? Yeah, no, I just find it funny how it's like, they asked your character, are, are you an incel? No, they didn't. They didn't. They, didn't. they were laughing, but Doxy was, like, saying oh. out loud their thoughts. Oh... Okay. So you're like, is this person some kind of incel? Or is that, you know, the, 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 I'm just like, and we're like, Doxy, no! I'm like, oh, my poor changeling. Like, <laughs> like and the truth is that they're there to hunt down and kill a vampire. And hey, by the way, we think you're said vampire. So, my poor guy is sitting there having to play this off. Like, 
Yeah, this is the reason why I was curious because you're right. human and I see you got all these women and I want to know how you know what's your secret and all this right. stuff. So I just like, so when he heard them all giggling, he it kind of clicked and he was like, oh, oh no, they heard that whole fucking thing. Oh. And he's, so they're the meanwhile. The, by the way, the reason I keep switching pronouns is because since they're a changeling, I yeah. made it canonical that they go by whatever. Yeah, gender fluid. Yeah, gender. They go by whatever, but. Uh, they are like. Hold on, let me. Where's the? I have a picture of what they look like. Oh yes, like, please. Like their 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 base form, because they, I, I I love being a changeling because this this my changeling has shifted faces so many times, almost every single session. Ooh. Yeah, they they love to change regularly. So I, he, she, they, but. They tend to lean more towards. Them. They they lean more mask, but hmm. they have been going very feminine lately. Nice. Uh. Let me where it, look at your D DMs. Your DMs. Oh. I that will. That is their. That is like their base. Oh! Oh, look at they them! Have, they have, yeah, these are very handsome. Nice. But, yes, but that, that's like the base that they go off of. Like, So, if they're not dressing up, they're gonna usually look like that. Oh, okay. Yeah, but they've been dressing up a note. And again, the vampire has been more into women, so you can imagine he, they've been very feminine. Like they actually currently, uh, what what were they again? Oh no, what was the thing? Uh, they're an Aladrin female right now. Oh okay. Yeah, kind of like for well, they're right now they're an Aladrin female. Um, prior to that. They were a tabaxi female and a herring gone female. Oh, okay. Yeah, they were trying to get information, so they would just keep shifting. But because of where the, the region that they're in, right? Apparently, is very um, like it's a city, so people come and go. <clears throat> but it's it's home to like polarkin, tabaxi, more of the like the bestial races, right? That can withstand the cold. Oh, okay. Yeah, so like Tabaxi, Polarkin, um, Herringon, I think too. A couple of other races. There's also, uh, I think, mm. I think they were dwarves. I think it was the dwarves that lived there. But it, it's a mixed bag. So because of that, they're like, okay, well, to make it look like a local, they did a Tabaxi first. But then I was like, okay, now I've got to switch to something else because I got caught. So they be they were like, okay, what about cute and shy? We can go the cute and shy route. So they tried to be um, the herring gone. And then they're like, okay, well, let's try something more exotic. So Eladrin, because it's a fae, and you know, what's a fae doing outside of the right. wild? Hmm. Mind you, the funny part is that is the first time that they uh for lack of a better term, cosplay as a as a as a fae, as another fae. They they tend to like non fae like they they'll do whatever, but for them for so far in this entire campaign they've been mostly everything but a fae. Right. And as far as in terms of appearance. Huh. <laughs> there we go, that's who I'm looking for. <clears throat> but yes uh where we left it off basically is we have now confirmed 
that our vampire is indeed our vampire. Oh. We also happened to find one of the missing women. Ooh. But now we have to figure out, are these women here willingly? Why were the... Because the thing that was, like, strange is that vampires cannot come in unless invited in. Right. However, at the scene of every single home in which one of the women went missing, doors and or windows were left open. But a vampire has to be let in. So we're like, wait, so why were the doors and or windows open? And then um, I I got a really, that's where my one, that's where my second dirty 20 came in. Right. I got a really high uh, religion check. Hmm. And um, and basically I, we ended up figuring out with my check, I was like, okay, it's possible that vampires can sometimes have thralls. Oh boy. So now, yeah, so we're like, are now we need to figure out are these women here willingly? Are they his thralls? And there are children in the home, which he has admitted some are his and some are not. Oh boy. So we're like, huh. Are the children aware of, you know, their lineage? Are they aware of what's going on? Right. Or are some of the children also thralls? And the woman that we found happens to be a missing wife, but the uh, Doxy was like, well, she looks like her picture, but there's some very noticeable changes. So we're like, oh god, was she turned? Oh boy. <laughs> Yeah, so we're, we're sitting here like, all right, we've confirmed amongst ourselves based on things we have found and things we have seen and all this other information that we've been able to put together that this is our vampire. Right. Now we have to figure out, all right, we've all, we were able to buy ourselves some time because we we're like, hey, can we tour the house while we wait for the night time? Because they're like, well, we could take you back to, to town and we're like, that's great. And we're like, that's cool. Yeah, we'll we'll take you up on that offer. In the meantime, mind if we tour your house? <laughs> to which they agreed, but they're like, oh, you can search it. I'm just, just understandably do recognize it from my point of view. I do need to put an escort. And we're like, that's fine. And who was the escort? But the human woman that we needed to talk to. Oh, and we're like, great. And that's where session ended. Woo! So we're like, all right, how do we do this? We have a limited amount of time. Like, we're here. In a house, you know, like, we're here. So. Oh, that little shit took your money. Anyway. Oh, uh, so, like, yeah, it was a cliffhanger because we're like, no! We need to keep going! Right! <laughs> we need to fucking Now, as a player, he tripped up because my character was asking him, I was like, hey, you know, you mentioned some of your women from, were from, some of your ladies were from the city. And there's been rumors of a vampire in the city. And he hesitated. Oh. Uh -huh. So as a player, we figured it out, but I failed the insight check, so my character didn't. Right. But as a player, he was just like, mm. Rumors of a vampire? Mm, haven't heard anything like that. Tend to stay out of those rumors. Don't like any drama. I was like, uh huh. And I was like, well, what about your ladies? Like, you obviously go into town for your ladies. Are they? They're from the city. You're not worried for them. It's like, no, no, I trust them. You know, it's fine. I trust them. So if they're safe. That's all that matters. And I was like, hmm. Oh, okay. And uh, officially, though, we were able to figure it out because the fairy uh, just, like, shook his hand. But based on our information and everything and all that we know, uh, he was basically a block of ice when she touched him, which is not how a human feels. Right. Plus the fact that they said that they're like, oh, it's just par for the course. 
you know, like they don't like the sunlight you know, like, because I was able to talk to one of the ladies. Right. Before I got caught, and she was like, and she was like, oh, it'll ha it'll have to be at nighttime because this character, and she mentioned the name. She's like this, is the character, she she's not really much of a sun person, and she said, oh, that's just par for the course. I was like, oh. oh. There's more than one. There's three of them bitches in the house. Oh fuck. Yeah, that's why I was like, we cannot get caught here. We, we fucking cannot get caught here. We will flip and fuck it. We will die? Or we will end up becoming food? A throw. There's a thousand and one different things that could happen if we get caught here. But we ain't leaving this place alive. That's for fucking damn shit. Right? Which, honestly, uh, I also flirted with a vampire. Don't judge me. <laughs> he was flirting back. <laughs> I mean, if it's Listen, consensual. It, it was. He flirted with me. I flirted with him. And he's like, well, um, literally at one point, he was just like, you know, you're all very pretty. And I was like, oh, yes, I fucking am, good sir. <laughs> but um, yeah, at one point he was like, because uh, the head vampires are males. So I was like, right. at one point he was like. Oh, he's like, you know, it's usually, it's like most people don't know I'm a changeling until after the fact when we've done what we've done. You be the first one to know that I am one prior to. And uh, let me tell you, it's pretty fun to be whatever the fuck I want when I want. And he's like, mm, I'd imagine. It seems like you'd be uh, quite fun in the bedroom. He's like, I agree. Just name your time and just name time and place. It's like, well, <laughs> right now would not be a good time, considering that your friend appears nervous. However, uh, maybe some other time. His right response to that was just like, well, I know where to find you now, so time and place, honey. Dude, was like, you're funny. I like you. <laughs> <laughs> Why did I feel like if Might you be. were, like, not in a good spot, that he probably would have turned you into a thrall? Oh, most le most definitely. It's like, huh? The only thing to do is get me in bed, or just, or some some other form of, like, like we don't know. But that's the other thing too is that we don't know the extent of what he can or cannot do. Oh. We still have not, because again, we've only just confirmed that he's the vampire that we're looking for. We yeah. just confirmed that. You don't know we if don't he's know. a thrall himself. Yeah, we don't know. Well, well, no, we know he's not the thrall. We know he's the one. Uh, he's the. Oh, vampire. he's the mastermind of what it. What we don't know is we haven't confirmed if there is or isn't thralls. Oh. Uh. We don't know if we don't know if he's turned any of them. For sure, for sure. Like, again, there's so many unknowns. It's like, we're here and we have a limited amount of time. But we also, now that we've been caught, we cannot tell him, hey, yeah, we've been sent to, we've been sent by the city to hunt down a vampire. Right. We think it's you. Like, because I think it's like, we don't know the extent of his powers. We don't know how, what he can do. We don't know, like, if he does have thralls, like, how, what is the extent of his control over said thralls? It's, there's too many unknowns at the moment, so next time we'll have to see where we end up. Right. But we now have confirmation that this is our vampire and we are in the right place. Not to mention, again, we found a woman, one of the missing women. Oh. Who happens to be our escort. Let's go. So now it's like, oh, now we can interrogate you without interrogating you and there will be no suspicion because... Remember, he said we can walk around this house with an escort. Who happens to be the escort for her? <laughs> so. But yeah, that's what I was like, when you said vampires, I was like, oh. That, that is awesome though. <laughs> I am loving this story. Oh, if you want to see that all the... Mind you, I'm obviously, like, skimming a lot of right. details. Because it's a long... But, like, Doxy does put up the vaults if you want to see the entire adventure. Oh, Spee. Do you want... Uh, Star, also, because I've been working on a few things with Florg. Do you want to see what has been updated so far for the custom uh, tabletop RPG? Yes. 
because I was also trying to work up a name for it, and I don't remember getting word from Flarg on what he thought would be good. Actually, let me check my DMs. Oh god, that kind of a commission. I've got to start it tomorrow. God, that thing is going to kill my hands. And on top of that, it's 83 rows long. Oh, wow. But that's just the base pattern. I still have, it's going to be longer than 83 rows because I have to extend it out to add the date. Right. All right. Uh, star. There it is. And then speed. I will obviously look at this tomorrow. Yeah. But yeah, that's my story. Nice. So yeah, this is did now you see why we were all so fucking invested because right. most of this is like it's because it's a homebrew a homebrew uh, sandbox D and D. Pretty much whatever we want to do, we do. Hmm. This story has been the lo the most the longest consistent story because like I said, it's we're this is the second session and now we're about to go into a third session with this vampire case. Ow. You okay? I cut my eye. Ow? How? Oh my nail the edge of my nail caught it. I was I you don't like when you're scratching an itch? Yeah. I was scratching an itch and then I I caught I guess the edge of my nail caught my skin and was like ha ah, Oh I think it's think I think thankfully it's just surface level, but I'm like I still feel it when I blink now. Right. Elden ring win. <laughs> Tell you what, if we get to a hundred bucks uh, before Sunday for the affiliate anniversary, I will plan another Elden Ring stream. Because we're at forty-five bucks you right now Kagi on the Donathon. Fuck out of that. What? So you and Kagi both were loving the fuck out of that. Game. You're not wrong. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Oh no, I don't like it. I can't play this type of game. Kagi was liking it more than me because I, I was getting frustrated, namely just because it's a new mechanic that we're having to get used to. <laughs> but you figured it the fuck out. Yeah, but also considering we've been getting back into like older games like Parasite Eve and games like that, you have to die a lot in, in order to be able to learn patterns. It honestly feels similar in mechanic to Elden Ring, and that's probably that's probably going to help us be more prepared and get not as frustrated with Elden Ring. I mean, to be fair, the other issue, too, was the controller wasn't working, so... Yeah. So because it wasn't registering properly, you couldn't even see the things that I had to tell you what they were. Yeah. Well, also having also to understand a whole set of controls with a different controller. Yes. Also, speed ow. Once managed to do that with a with a strand of my own hair. I brushed it out of the way while it was on my eye. Ow. Nishka, if you don't quit ringing that bell, I'm gonna shove it up your ass. You can ring my bell. No, don't, 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 don't you come back here. <laughs> Come here, you little fucking shit. Come here. Look at, hold on, I'm gonna turn my camera on. Look at those little shit. Uh, I get to see the I get to see the pupper and y'all can't. 
She's like, mother. Look her in the face. Look her in the face and tell her what you've done. <laughs> arr, arr. Don't do that. That's not. Mishka. Arr, arr, arr. That's my hair. Get it out your mouth. <laughs> this little shit. Little shit. Don't lick that. Don't do that. Mm. Go, Mishka, go. No. Yeah. Mishka, no. <laughs> Cause know. the chaos here, born to heal. <laughs> no. Try to her to ring the bell. She's been doing this for three hours straight. <laughs> <laughs> what did she originally uh, learn to ring the bell for? Ringing the bell is to go potty time, but it's late and she knows she's not supposed to ring it this late. Uh... I know she doesn't have to go, but also she's doing it because she wants my attention. So she rings the bell, whines and cries, and then stares at me like, Mom? <laughs> so I, was Silly like, I, know, I know, I know, I know for a fact. You don't gots to go. You you go like three times a day, and I take you out three times a day. We don't take you out five, six, seven times a day. But that's the problem is his little smart ass has figured out when you ring the bell, you make me stop to go and look at you. So I've had to like fight with her. It's like, I can't have you not ringing the bell because I need to know when you go want to go outside. But also you take it, don't know. I didn't say the word. <laughs> uh, but I need to know when she needs to go. Fucking Christ, I can't stop perking up your ears. <laughs> I need to know. She's so like, attention? She knows, attention? She Hello? She gets my attention when she rings the bell. <laughs> That's like, you little fucking shit. I love you, but why are you this smart where you figured out the damn it? That's like, I supposed to have trained you, not the other fucking way around. <laughs> Your dog is fucking Pavlov to you. Uh, how does it feel to be outsmarted by your own dog? Listen here. This little bitch thinks she she has me this little bitch thinks she wins and she thinks she's won she thinks she knows you don't know shit Mishka. <laughs> oh y'all are deciding don't my fate me. don't look away from me y you know Fucking what eyes when I'm talking. actually no we won't have enough time to Maybe do something like that <laughs> See? There we go. That's what you get, Spee. Oh. <laughs> the gates of Purgatory is opened again. Oh, snap! Wait, why does my health say I only have three hearts? I should have plenty more than that. Because you only have three hearts. But yes, it's 11.40, and I wanted to mostly share because I was like, this is a fun story. Yeah. But you need but to go yes, sleep? If y'all want, want to see such fun story, you can go to Doxy Baby on YouTube and watch the VODs from the beginning, where I almost didn't have a bard character to play because I almost died in the first session. <laughs> You're christening. Why friend shape if not friend? <laughs> We fought a shadow dog, and I captured it successfully, and I was going to make it mine, and then my friend became not my friend, and almost killed me. No! Yeah, it, uh, it decided, I don't like that you tied me up, grew big, and chomp chomped on my sides. Oh no! 
and then literally said, I'm gonna beat a motherfucker with another motherfucker and use me as a weapon. Wow. That's why I almost died. Uh, thankfully they killed it. Ah, uh, because I failed the first death roll. Huh? So they managed to kill it and give me a medicine check to revive me. Yay! But yeah, I almost didn't have a changeling bard and I was like, this is the first session! Sometimes it can be brutal like that. Why, friend shape? It's not friend. <laughs> Oh god. You okay? Oh, my nose is acting out. Because of course it would right before I oh. go to bed. Yeah, you, oh, yes, I really you work tomorrow, to don't you? Yes, that's why I say I really must go to bed. Yeah, go to bed. It is 11.42, almost midnight, and I work tomorrow. You heard the word! Bed, go! Now! Thank you. Yes, I have my dog that train where I literally just say the word bed and she walks off to bed. <laughs> and not my bed, her bed. Yeah. But yeah, you all have a good night. I'm glad I could entertain y'all with my D&D &D session stories. Uh, let's see what happens next week, Wednesday. You got this. I better. I want to kill that motherfucker. You humiliated me. <laughs> For all your ladies. But yeah, uh, Speed, check your DMs because I sent you uh, the work in progress on the tabletop. And yeah, actually, I guess I'll that tomorrow. That actually just reminded me. I'm trying to what? work on a name for it, but I am struggling. Well. Y'all yeah, have a good night. You enjoy your streams. I e. was usually I was gonna come in here and say my usual thing. Oh my god, they say you say yip yip and they come. Oh my god, it's Appa. <laughs> but uh, yeah, Mishka just comes when I say her name. She literally comes to me. Nice, smart my, pumper. My dog is trained. But it's just she is, but she's stubborn, and that's just like, bitch, I'm more stubborn than you. You want to have a stubborn fight? Let's go. She gets it from her mama. Oh. <laughs> I, have I have literally had to go. There was one time where she was trying to, like, dominate me, and I was like, oh, no, you fucking don't. You think I'm not afraid to get down on your level? I literally got down on her, like, and growled at her before I bit her by the collar. Well, like, snap. The back of her neck. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, by the back of her. Oh, she stopped right there. She's like, yeah, no. She went down full submissive pose. I was like, fucking bet. That's what I thought. Nice. Yeah, I said I was stubborn. This little bitch is not getting away <laughs> with trying to do it. No. All right, you uh, should probably go bed. Yeah, I've been med midwesterning goodbye this shit. I gotta go. <laughs> really? E, you have a good night. You too, bye. Bye. I need to move people. All right. Uh, I'm trying to think what all can be done. Need to wait on more resources. I know.
We'll do this on I'm. Y'all heard it. If y'all really want Elden Ring, get us to a hundred bucks before Sunday for uh, the optional donuts. Folks are befuddled. Well, if it isn't the usurper, hello, Lem. Don't know why I go for voices like that. Because they are fun. Yeah, you're not wrong. Panda! No, the siblings are fighting! <laughs> You have a very light stomach. Third time you fucking break the thing. Thank you for the water and the noms. I will do that after I have to take care of these guys. And the stretchies, thank you. Weren't those two smashing hard enough to break something? <laughs> thank you for the contribution to the totem! There you go. Poor baby. How many times is this going to get fucking destroyed? Thank you for the contribution. <laughs> Y'all? Are you gonna be good? Are you gonna be good? You are right next to shit, Tree of Blood! Legal! Bad! Fine. There we go. What keeps breaking is a little thing that's meant to, like, basically spell out extra propaganda to make people work more. But I never use it. You get more destroyed the more you complain about it? Clearly! Ah. 
doing a stretch. I'm doing a stretch. Oh! Actually, real quick. For snackies, I'm gonna get some crackers. Sorry if the crackle is really bad. I will put the crackers over on this side. Okie dokie. Here we go. Oh shoot, it's almost midnight. <laughs> uh, roll click. Wow. Let's see how we might write out two. You know what? I haven't rated that to these tiers in a while. Um, they are a husband and unless you guys have um, the like funds to like redeem the guy at the raid, I think we will raid out to the game Grotto. They are a husband and wife duo of game developers and game lovers. And currently it looks like Meg and Dono are playing uh, Final Fantasy XIV with some friendos. So I think that might be fun to watch. I'll, I'll probably bother you in DMs. I mean, we still got a few minutes, but I want to prepare just in case. Thank you for streaming. Yeah. Oof. Actually, you know what? The little spoons are starting to get to me. So let's... Let's get the raid message out. There's the version for passersby. Here is the version for There's the version for followers and here's the version for subscribers. As a reminder for those that are hopping in and be and like sticking around in the stream and don't know what we do around here. This is the road to dusk. You can call me road, dusk, anything that you would call a friend. I am a dream usher focusing on sleep, dreams, and the imagination to help create an environment where people can learn to be the better versions of themselves. I have a, a collaborative discord server with my partner system. Uh, you can check out that right here. Like our streams, the community is 18 plus, we are LGBTQI2 Spirit Plus, Neurodivergent, Disability, and Mental Health Forward. We also do our best to uplift and advocate for BIPOC voices regarding their own experiences. Um, if you guys want any info on like any updates on us, not only can you check out our Discord, but you can also check out our card, which has links for not only our socials, but also little tidbits on myself and other members of my system who plan to front and be part of stream somewhat often. Um, that said, um, 
we do have a uh, early bird opening for donations when it comes to an optional donathon that we have going on in congruence to a giveaway for our two-year affiliate anniversary that will be happening Sunday, the 22nd of September, starting at noon Eastern. So we'll be going for 24 hours with that, with a lovely start that I have tried to be transparent with uh, throughout stream and to the community with uh, Top Hat, my, my nesting partner, uh, starting us off with an epic Mickey speed run, his second attempt, while I have to go to work. So <laughs> hopefully that's something that people are okay with. And with that, let's get the raid message officially out to Game Grotto. Do you know that while this is the end of stream, this is not the end of our time together as a road to desk will always be open for another adventure. Thank you all so, so, so much for sticking around. Please have a wonderful rest of your morning, afternoon, evening, whatever time it is in your time zone, as we say. Bye bye.